One of the reasons that I love being a structural engineer is that every building I enter, every bridge I cross, every structure that I see, I'm understanding it. It's almost like if you play an instrument, you have such a deeper understanding of what you're hearing. Where a lot of times when I see structures, what's going on in my head is the mathematics behind it. And it influences every moment of my life. When I became a faculty member, it was just a couple of years in that the Northridge earthquake happened. They found that steel structures were having fractures. Many of these structures were new. They were designed to code, and this was a good size earthquake, but not the largest that this region can get. And so we developed new structural systems to reorient where the forces go during an earthquake into replaceable components and leave the rest of the structure damage free, like the old fuses in the basement. And indeed, early adopters started implementing structural systems like this. We were off to the races. I'm very appreciative to have been elected to the National Academy of Engineering. It's a wonderful organization. I've known Jerry since he started at Northeastern. Jerry is an ideal colleague. We are supposed in academia to have the following profile, 40% research, 40% teaching, and 20% service. I don't know how Jerry does it, but he works 100% on each. Working with Professor Hajar is probably one of the best experiences that I've had at Northeastern. He is one of the professors that you can go to and know that you are being heard. Jerry just epitomizes what this university is about. He is a leader in the field, and it's just a fitting tribute to Jerry's accomplishments in his, in his scientific career that he this year was elected to the National Academy. So I'm especially happy to have won this at Northeastern University uh, because for me, Northeastern has been a world of opportunity. And uh, this is a university where you can dream big and execute those dreams. When I look back on my career, I had no clear path from beginning to end. When I left graduate school, I said to myself, I am never going back to academia. Never, never, never. And yet I became a professor, and I'm very happy I did. When I was a professor, I never thought to myself, I'm gonna be a department chair. It just never crossed my mind. But then got contacted by Northeastern University and talked to the people here about the great opportunity, and it has been fantastic. So the path has really been exciting, and I've been able to do what I do only because of the great mentors that I've had, because of the great colleagues that I've had, because of the great students that I've had and I am so appreciative for all the opportunities that I've had. Jerry, I was absolutely thrilled at the news that you'd been elected to the National Academy. You bring incredible honor to Northeastern University. Congratulations, Professor. Jerry, we are all very proud of your achievements, and we are fortunate to have you as a colleague.